Hello, Vault Dwellers. Firstly, fuck off. Don't don't really. That's just me being the asshole. I'm getting I'm getting into character. Got to do this. Today we're going to try and get through as much of the Citadel as possible. And of course, I gained three points last episode. So we're going to pop one more into Assault Rifle, get that maxed out as quickly as possible. And I'm going to try and move my way to Heavy Armor as quickly as possible. Yeah, yeah, I got Shield Boost. Woo. Uh, because I don't have any, I can't put any more into Intimidate yet. I'm not going to worry about that. That always gets priority. But, let's see where we are. Alright. I don't own this place yet. Glad yeah, fuck off, Caden. Uh, am I going to do any of the crew things? Uh, probably going to do... Rex and Tali. Is Tali... Yeah, Tali has a pilgrimage. As far as I remember. Well, there's tons of stuff we can do. Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. Ah, Joker. No one cares about you. All your breakable legs. Whoosh. It's still a damn pretty game. Yeah, pretty. It's all one. Yeah, boy. I still like the look of the SR1. Most people prefer the SR2, the but size of that ship. The you know, other people are assholes. Fleet. Well, size isn't everything. <laughs> Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying, you need firepower too. Pretty sure it's lasers good. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Word. Good thing it's on our side then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Normandy out. We almost had a moment that I've been looking forward to for years. Where are you, reporter lady? Where's your face? This is an outrage! The council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action. You don't get to make demands of the council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Saren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew. Clearly you don't know how, how the ground team from spaceships Ebron. work. It, it takes more than request. six people to fly one of those the things. mission reports. I assume they're accurate. They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top, top robot agent. agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. I'm not going to sit on my ass just because the Council doesn't want to do anything. If they won't stop Seren, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than I enough don't to settle you down. Ooh, Dina. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That Saren's you don't know hurts. me. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. Why, thank you. And that's why I hate politicians. That's why I hate you. Yeah. Look at that red gate just pouring in.
Boop. Uh, can't remember what mission that is. Uh, we will probably end up going there at some point. Oh, I can be an asshole to the Elcor. Hello there, human. Sincere apology, but I am here on business and cannot be distracted right now. Sorry to interrupt. Go about your business. Thanks to you, human. Good day. Uh... Please greeting. Human, it is always good to see your kind. Not today, I am it's Ambassador Kalon. Genuine query. Is there something I can do for you this day? Goodbye, I'm Nah, I don't feel like talking to you, people. See your farewell. Good day to you, human. Enjoy your time on the Citadel. Yeah, I'm not even gonna give you the time of day, bub. Uh, that doesn't even open. No, 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 no. It really just wants me to go straight to the council meeting. Anyone here for me to piss off? No. I can't believe I landed a job here. It's uh, free a XP. Human delighted welcome. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I'm totally not going into your room to hack this here console. Or try to, anyway. I didn't touch it. It's fine. There we go. Ah, uh, uh, that's the... The mission with the biotics that are trying to get compensation or something. Me. Oh, I haven't talked to the husband yet. Let's actually quickly go do that. I just want to get to the reporter. Oh, wow, the husband wasn't there. Let's just go be an asshole to the council. Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. Oh, Garrus, you sexy, sexy man. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vicarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Sounds like you came up empty. Saren's a specter. Most of his activities are classified. I couldn't find anything solid. But I know he's up to something. Like you humans say, I feel it. You're not human. I think the council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen oh, to you. I was trying to be an asshole to him. Why is it so difficult to blame people for everything? I mean, uh, he's stupid in his stupid face. And his face is also stupid. And not in any way alien sexy. Hearings already started. Come, Come on. on, I just took a slight detour. The Geth attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. The investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker. Is hardly compelling proof. Oh God, I hate I those. I resent these accusations. 
Nihilus was a fellow Spectre, and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. You're the one who destroyed the beacon, then you tried to cover it up. Shift the blame to cover your own failures, just like Captain Anderson. Oh, I hate you so much, sir. But what can you expect from a human? You can expect me to kill you the next time we need it. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor, and mine. You can't hide behind the Council forever. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the Beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must well, be based the vision on had nothing to do with Sarah. It had to do with the Reapers. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren Assholes. and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. This meeting is adjourned. Oh, he, he not happy with me right now. He's slightly upset with my actions. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Sounds Every plausible. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. We need to deal with Saren ourselves. As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. He's a Turian. I don't want him on our side. Not all Turians are like Saren. If he can help, we need to find him. I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. You can't just cut Captain Oh wait, that wasn't an asshole move. The Ambassador's right. I need to step aside. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. Harkin's probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. I thought you said he was a drunken loser. Couldn't hurt to go talk to him. Just be careful. I wouldn't call him reliable. I should go. Good Let's luck, do Shepard. this. I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything Wait, else. I think we can already go pick up Rex. If I'm right. Oh, that is not the correct way. At all. There's the council. There's the route I want to take. Hmm. That guy's up. What? Oh, no, no, I wasn't. Never mind. Um, yes, is there something you want? Why are you so interested it's in It's a lot of free XP and papers? free money. I've got no interest in the keep. Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh... I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. We're just talking. Is there something wrong with that? Do I need to take out no. my gun? I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the keepers. So far I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well, I don't really... I'd like to do it more openly. But it's not really worth getting arrested over. I can help you I out. I don't even know who you are. I'm Commander hmm. Shepard. 
You'll need this. After this is in a playthrough, dude. Your way for each unique scan. I should get going. So long. And like, uh, as much as I want to do as much as possible, I don't really feel like sitting through all the conversations is necessary. I was just hoping for some renegade options, but they didn't give it to me. They don't want me to be bad. It's definitely one this side. Boop. Uh, I'm just gonna quickly check out a setting or two. There we go, that gets rid of the frame lag. Getting little bits of frame lag is really annoying. Uh, no, I'm waiting. Commander. Commander. Oh, I don't know enough yet for that. I think I actually have to find the squad that's dead. Before he'll talk to me. Uh, you've been scanned. Don't be ridiculous. The Volus won't be joining the council for years. I'm not so sure. The humans are making a strong case. When you conduct a poll, it's easy. I want to go to C Sec. Pick up my main man, Rex. I loved the elevators in these things. They were the longest elevators in the world. All it's doing is hiding a, a load screen. Whoa, that is causing some weird ass blur effects. I can't believe the council ignored all the evidence against Saren. Saren is one of their best operatives. It's only natural they take his word. So now we just chase leads while this smug Turian runs around with his Geth trooper. Ah, shut up, both of you. If I didn't have to bring people on my missions, I wouldn't. And that's why you don't take the elevators. Look at that bug... Please do not disturb the keeper. Hey, please do not disturb the shut up, stupid VR. Welcome to the Presidium. Ha. 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 I know what you are. That's endgame stuff right there. No, I don't want to go exploring. I want, uh, yeah, let's go straight to Chorus then. No, I, ah, uh, I keep forgetting. I'm actually trying to get to Seasick as quickly as possible. Seasick, mm. yeah. well, it's right underneath the embassies, I think. If I'm right. I think it's a uh, good way here. I think that's uh, the way I need to go. Yeah, that's uh, the route I need to get to the place. Yeah, yeah, these two sec. Oh, I have to use the elevator because I haven't gone there before. Swish, 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 swish. swish. 
In light of the Is Rex even going to be Eden there yet? Crime, many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. Many colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. Oh, now neither of you want to say anything? Jeez. Normally you two never shut up. Hmm. Looks like I can't grab Rexit. To the den of Korra, then. And no, not the Avatar. That's her. Wait, why am I using my pistol? Shit, I took a lot of damage. Boom. Boom goes the dynamite. I'll get all that health back fairly quickly. I'm not worried. Let's upgrade that. Combat sensor. Do wait. Uh, nope. Get that knock over. All targets down. Uh, yeah, no, it's only when we assault the thing that there is more. told us to take you down. Oh, Show they can't. What are you waiting for? I'm standing Look right here. Look how badass he looks. This is Fist's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. Out of my way, humans. I have no quarrel with you. What was that all about? Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught. We're gonna take that. We're gonna work with it. It's gonna be awesome. Yeah, sweetheart, you looking for some fun? I gotta say, that soldier get up looks real good on that body of yours. Can I punch him? Why don't you sit your sweet little ass down beside old Harkin? Have a drink. We'll see where this goes. I'd rather drink a cup of acid after chewing on a razor blade. You trying to hurt my feelings? You gotta do better than that. After 20 years with CSEC, I've been called every name in the book, princess. Call me princess again and you'll be picking your teeth up off the floor. Now tell me where Garrison is. Acceptable. Okay, okay, just relax. Garrison. <laughs> you must be one of Anderson's crew. Poor bastard's still trying to bring Saren down. I know where Garrus is. You gotta tell me something first. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? Just tell me where Garrus is before this gets ugly. But it's all related. Don't oh, you shut see? up. The captain used to be his specter. Didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush hush. The first human ever given that honor, and then he blew it. He screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians set him up. <laughs> Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. Thank you. She runs the med clinic on the other side of the wards. From last I heard, he was going back there. I'm out of here. That was only like pulling yeah, teeth. I can't believe I didn't get any renegade for that though. And like, how did I even get that paragon? What? Oh, I can't actually get it. Why? Maxed assault rifle. Maxed armor. <laughs> Why don't you mind your own business? I hate Ashley so much. Can I go to wards now? 
Med Clinic. I actually want to go to CSEC because now I can pick up Rex. I had to go to Cora's Den first. I remember that now. Because I want to at least pick up Rex, get um, get Garrus as well. And then next episode, we're going to be assaulting Cora's Den again. All right. Why is Rex not being assaulted? I want to pick him up as soon as possible, so I don't want to waste time. Let's go get Garrus. Maybe Garrus has to be the first alien we accept into our team. I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was and you're never enough. going to. Now if Garrus comes around, oh no, wait, you, I want you to tell me. Who are you? Let her go. Oh, nice shot. Ah! by shooting your knee if I have to. Need to use the med pack or something. Stupid asshole. Don't think I won't just go through that. Oh, did something happen to your... Did, did your barrier break? Clear. Did it break? Sad. Wait, no, no. There we go. Yeah, I'm that kind of asshole. Mm -hmm. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get lucky. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks to you. All of you. Why were they threatening you? Who do they work for? They work for Feast. They wanted to shut me up. Keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. What Quarian? A few days ago, a Quarian came by my office. She'd been shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Then what? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? <laughs> That's stupid even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. That I offer him something, something as well. Saren Couple wants. bullets. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker. She must have something that proves he's a traitor. Did the Quarian mention anything about Saren or the Geth? She did. The information she was going to trade. She said it had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Time we paid Fist a visit. I can't click this my neck again. Show, Shepard, but I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. I don't need a Turian shooting me in the back when I least expect it. All Turians are not the same. I'm not like Saren. I couldn't find the proof I needed in my investigation, but I knew what was really going on. Saren is a traitor to the Council and a disgrace to my people. You can come along, but I'll be watching. Yeah! You know, we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take We'll go home. pick up Rex. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. A Krogan might come in handy. I just used them. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. What's he doing there? Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in <laughs> for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out. Uh, yeah. And Ashley. I finally got rid of Caden. I need two Renegade for that. I would have to kill to get more renegade. Wait, 
Uh, did I spam a level up? Yeah, I did. Can't remember these things, okay? Nice view. Okay. Oh, did I get you? No, I didn't. Whoop. 10 XP. Uh, C sec, please. There's my buddy, my pal, my friend, my muchacho. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. That'll take orders hmm. from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. <laughs> you want me to arrest you? I want you to try. That worker is like... That security Go guard on. is like, get out of here. I'm going to stop you. Do I know you, human? I'm going after Fist. I don't want you getting in my way. Huh. Now I recognize you. Commander Shepard from the Alliance. Heard a lot about you. We're both Are warriors, his teeth Shepherd. metal? Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work oh, together. God damn it, Garrus. My people have a saying. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. I think we're going to get along just fine, Rex. It wasn't Let's an go. asshole thing to say about it. I hate to keep Fist waiting. <laughs> Look at that combat strength. I just really wanted to get rid of Caden and Ashley. We're just gonna finish up with Cora's Den and then. Okay, nothing. Hoo ha! Let's do this. Take cover! I think he needs a stiff drink. Go, go, go. I'm on it. You. I'm still doing a counter shield. I was doing a count shields till the guy at the top decided to be a dickhole. And you did. Oh wow, he's got my entire shield though. Oh, can't you shoot around the corner? Just die! Incoming! Did not mean to do that. Badoom. Stop right there! Don't come any closer. Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back, or we'll shoot. I just killed fifty bodyguards to get in here. What do you think I'll do to you? Uh, well. Uh... <laughs> Screw Fist. He doesn't pay us enough for this. I didn't even take out my gun with him. Would have been quicker to just kill them. Shooting people isn't always the answer. Let's get into that quick. Banshee 2. I actually think that might be better. Avenger 1, Banshee 2. Less damage, can fire more. Uh, I haven't overheated my gun yet. I'm fine with this the way it is. Nothing better there. Nothing better there. Uh, nothing really better there. Yeah, let's just uh, step in here quickly.
I don't like that I do don't have a good grouping for very long. Wait! Don't kill me, I surrender! Tell me where the Quarian is and I won't have to shoot you in the kneecaps. She's not here, I don't know where she is, that's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me okay. kill him. Wait, wait, I don't know where the Quarian is, but I know where you can find her. The Quarian isn't here, said you'd only deal with the Shadow Broker himself. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired to... Because Rex is pretty badass, you'd expect him to be hired directly. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker, ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. Tell me where that meeting is before I blow your lying head off. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them. I'm right gonna now. have to get there really you fast. Make it if you hurry. There we go. Boom. I have no problem. What are you doing? The shadow broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. A lot of people died because of him. He had it coming. Now let's move. We have to save that quarian. It's Tolly, of course we have to save her. Oh wait, I wanted to quickly grab the stone. Yeah, we'll take all of that. Okay, now we're gonna have to murder because usually I've got lots of single target damage for this portion of the fight. When I'm gonna have to Down. Thanks. We got them all, Shepard. I've never actually seen what happens if you don't get to her in time. Because it's so close. You have to be really slow inside there to lose out on her. Did you bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Smart move. Stupid Solarian. <laughs> what are they gonna do? Uh, we want to... Yeah, let's sabotage him. That was actually a really close call. Just set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. You've got proof Saren is working with the Geth. Hand it over. Not so fast. Who are you? I don't have time for questions. I need the evidence you have against Saren. I guess I owe you. But not out here in the open. We need to go somewhere safe. We could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards and all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? A Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? This Quarian can help us bring down Saren. I would have told you that if you hadn't jumped down my throat. Bitch. I apologize, Commander. This whole thing with Saren has me a bit on edge. Maybe we should just start at the beginning, miss. My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many questions. Bust Normandy. Here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage, my rite of passage into adulthood. Where's the proof you promised? During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. 
I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense method. What did you find out? Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. Sarens go down. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. Saren won't get out of this one. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. I love her voice. I love Tolly. Tolly is the best. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step yeah, closer we heard this to part. finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. They won't believe you anyway. Just keep them out of this. <laughs> we have to tell them. Even if they don't believe anything else, this proves Saren is a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the council right away. What about her? The Quarian? Oh, she my babu. My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me uh, come you. You can hide behind boxes like a little bitch. I think this is more than you can handle. She's already survived a run-in with the Geth Shepherd, and we need all the help we can get. Take her with you. Fine, go over my head. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. Actually, she my real baby. Oh. Do I... I, I have to... I uh, can't put anything else into Intimidate yet. But I can get heavy armor like a boss. Don't care about first aid. Yeah, let's get. Okay, it does do the damage increase as well. And increased accuracy. Good, good. Wait, I've got no points left. I only got two points. Oh, why did I only get two points? What's going on? Wow, I've got some stuff. But most of all, I have Hydra armor. Hell Hydra. Oh, and it looks cool. Uh, I don't have any Torian armor and I don't have any armor for you. We're going to go with that setup for now. I basically just wanted the armor because I should have two bars worth of armor now. Booyah! So, to finish off today's episode, we're gonna go talk to the council. Excuse me, Commander Shepard. Commander Shepard, my name is Samesh This Pati. is gonna hurt. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. A lot of people want my help these days. What makes you special? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation. But the military has refused my request. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. I'm concerned with the living, not the dead. I don't have time for this. I understand. You have many important things to do. If you do have time, however, Mr. Bosker is the man in charge of my case. He's in the expensive bar over there. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral. And the respect she deserves. Fine, let me just go, like, threaten him with a gun or something. Tell him he better do what I say. 
Otherwise, I'll kill him or something. Actually, I, I like the sound of that. Yeah, no. If you don't get back the body, I'm gonna shoot you in the face. My goodness, you're Commander Shepard. Your activities made for quite a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? You can cut the red tape for a grieving husband. I want you to release the body of Nerali Batya. Commander, nothing would make me happier. Serviceman Nerali Batya died on Eden Prime, as Mr. Batya no doubt told So did what you. Jenkins or whatever that asshole's name was. Get his body. We've seen before. That is why her body is being held. I don't care how badly the Geth mangled the body. It's the husband's right to claim her. We are not holding Nerali Batia's body out of discretion. We are, frankly, holding the body for research. That's kind of sick. The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, Serviceman Batia may save more lives in death than she did in life. You know who and what I am. If I want Nerali Batia, I can get her. Commander, I, I don't think threats are necessary. <laughs> Even if the body were here on the Citadel, would you really risk going in shooting to get it? You said you'd been briefed on me. You should know that I don't leave fallen troops Except Jenkins. Me. All right, Commander. You win. It was hard enough refusing Mr. Batia. I'm not going to risk an incident by refusing. Because I will kill you. Tell Samesh that the body is being shipped back to Earth. I'll go now to see to it myself. I will shoot you. Oh, renegade nine bitches. I'm so bad at this. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you the good news. Uh, and I didn't get to Hello shoot again, anyone. Commander. Has there been any word? Your wife is coming home, Mr. Don't sound so empathetic. Thank you. I will return home and begin my preparations. It does not bring me happiness. But it may bring me peace. Uh, your face is kind of generic there, buddy. And that whole sideways turn thing, I think I've seen it before. I also think they cloned some of the NPCs in this game. Uh, let's go talk to the council like I promised. Let's quickly finish up this episode. Because we are running way over time for the Citadel. Uh, we just go up to them. As I said, we're just gonna finish up with the council here. We're gonna. Come on. Udin is presenting. The There's one more thing I want to do, but I will do that next episode because it'll be a brilliant way to start Eden Prime something. Was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step. But the main part. Finding the conduit. Let's finish up with the end. Add one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. Bitch. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his That's crimes. not good enough. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Venezia. She must be working with the Geth, too. Matriarch Venezia is a powerful biotic, and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. No, when I kill her. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. I forgot how much I love the story of this game. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this Conduit is? Saren thinks it can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. That's why they're gonna Where did die. The Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same I'm mistake. I'm pretty much like this is the legend. Change. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. 50,000 years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is they never listen! Enough. 
you know ever hiding somewhere in the traverse send your fleet in a fleet cannot track down one man but one specter could a citadel fleet could secure the entire region keep the geth from attacking any more of our colonies or it could trigger a war with the terminus what systems. is the Pasadena? Like we won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies Every time humanity asks for help, you ignore us. Shepard's right. I'm sick of this council and its anti-human bullshit. Actually, I like it in here when I'm playing badass. There is another solution. A way to stop Saren that does not require fleets or armies. No, it's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. It was a Turian Spectre who betrayed this council. And it was a human who exposed him. I have earned this. And stop it, the future. Commander Shepard, step forward. Why are you gonna like knight me with a fucking sword or some shit? Oh, look at that. You feel so heroic with this game. I've done like jack shit, and I'm like, oh yes, I'm the baddest of asses. Oh, wow, the heavy armor looks cool. It is the decision of the Council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, the embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let them die so badly. <laughs> I'm not even gonna power. hesitate. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace, both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. Bow. I've been ready for this since Eden Prime. I've been ready for this since I was bald. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. I'll find him. This meeting of the council is adjourned. I'm a legend. Congratulations, Commander. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the CSEC Academy and speak to the Spectre Requisition you know how Officer. Expensive that Come shit is. Me. I'll need your help to set all this up. Bastard didn't even thank you. What do you expect from a politician? Come on. Right behind My broskies. My bros. But guys, that's what we're going to call today's episode. Because starting next episode, we should have a nice little conversation with a certain reporter. I'm so excited. Because it's going to have a really cool, really cool renegade option that I've never done before. It's going to be so awesome. But keep it real. So remember, please give me a thumbs up if you liked it. Thumbs down if you didn't. And if you can't, why don't you hit subscribe now.